Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Amita Singh. This is an introductory session of Elasticsearch. In this session, I will be covering what is Elasticsearch, why we need Elasticsearch. So let's get started. What is Elasticsearch? Elasticsearch is a search engine based on Lucene. Very well understood. It is a search engine. It provides a distributed multi-tenant capable full text search engine with an HTTP web, uh, web interface and schema free JSON documents. Okay, it provides a distributed environment, distributed system. That, that part I'll be covering in the next video. That is all about the basic concept of Elasticsearch. So, uh, next thing is it's a full text search engine. As we all know, in the RDBMS, the conventional SQL database management systems, these are not really designed for full text searches. And they certainly don't perform well against loosely structured raw data that resides outside the database. On the other hand, Elasticsearch converts raw data such as log files or message files into internal documents and store them in a basic uh, data structure similar to this JSON object. I'll be showing this JSON document, how it looks like everything in my next video. So, and the next, the one more important uh, difference between the Elasticsearch and uh, the RDBMS is, suppose we have the same hardware and we are, we are performing some operation. We have written some query and we are performing some operation. If the SQL query takes 10 seconds 10 second to fetch those information to perform that operation, on the other hand, the Elasticsearch will take less than 10 milliseconds. So this is a huge difference between Elasticsearch and RDBMS in terms of searching something, some, uh, in terms of performing some operation. Now Elasticsearch is developed in Java and released as uh, an open source under the term of Apache license. Very well understood, it's developed in, developed in Java and it's an open source. Why we need Elasticsearch? This is a point. So as I have already explained you the difference between RDBMS and Elasticsearch in terms of searching something, why it is better than that. Uh, there is one, I'll take one example about, uh, let's take an example of e-commerce website. Suppose as a customer, I'm searching some product on, this, on the e-commerce website. Sometimes it takes too much time, too long time for the retrieval of that product. And this leads to a poor user experience and in turns, uh, it turns off the potential customer. So to avoid these kind of issues, what, uh, we need Elasticsearch to implement fuzzy, simple searches, implement analytics, autocomplete, instant searches. Autocomplete means, suppose in Google you are writing something, you are typing and you are getting a suggestions related to your type. This is what we call autocomplete. Uh, so, I hope I have cleared your doubt why we need Elasticsearch. Let's proceed. Kibana, yeah. Here I am covering two things. One is Elasticsearch, other is Kibana. Kibana is uh, something where I have, I'm going to perform all the, all the operations, all the query writing, like index, index writing, create index creations, all I'm going to perform uh, in on the Kibana, uh, on developer tool in the Kibana. And in Elasticsearch, I'll be getting the reflection of whatever I performed in Kibana. So Kibana is a window into the Elastic stack. It enables visual exploration and real-time analysis of your data in Elasticsearch. Okay, I'll be showing you what, how it looks like, the Kibana and Elasticsearch. See, this is the URL of Elasticsearch. Elasticsearch, whatever uh, I'm creating, suppose I'm creating the index, I'll be covering everything, the basic concept of Elasticsearch in my next video. And this is what Kibana is, how it looks like. This is the developer tool. I'm going to perform all these query writing things over here. We have visual, we can visualize our thing. We have dashboards, everything. Uh, see here, we have something. Got. Okay, thanks for watching this video. Please like, share, 
and subscribe my channel thank you for watching